the um, author Wayne Barton, who I hope he's here to shake his hand. His book has been uh, a great help to me. Thank you, Wayne. Club legend also Tony Whelan. The title of the poem, which I'll share in a moment, comes from the dedication at the front of Tony's book. Congratulations to the sculptor, Alan Herriot, magnificent, and a particular thank you to the family, particularly Nick and Paul. Paul spoke with me to help me write the poem, and I shared the poem yesterday with the family, the son Nick, and Paul, the grandson, and they were very moved by it. And uh, if, if, to be able to say I'm sharing the poem today with the blessing of the family means a great deal to me. So will you join me please in, in sharing those thank yous? Thank you. Without further ado, Jimmy Murphy, without whom, Matt Busby, Jimmy Murphy, a friendship forged in war, bonded with a longing for the things worth fighting for, a Scotsman and a Welshman, both with Irish in their veins, to Manchester, united by the same love of the game. Both Catholic boys, both miners lads, but very different men. Their minds and souls combined their roles. And then, but then, and then, Old Trafford, 1948, all hope and money gone. Holes and craters, devastation, city, blitz with bombs. A bomb site for a stadium, a bonfire made of plans. That time our stands were taken made it time to take a stand. But they couldn't bomb our spirits, and they couldn't bomb our dreams, and they couldn't bomb the Busby Murphy. Vision for our teams through the trouble, through the struggle, through the rubble, both are clear. We will hold on to our values. Jimmy held his training here. Those values, those ambitions, play with passion play with flair. See those embers are remembered as a flame that burns in there. That spirit, lads, express yourself. We'll write on history's pages, but work hard to honour those who work so hard to pay your wages. And up together, back together, simple switch attack, and never, ever giving up and always coming back. With Busby, as the focus, Murphy, more behind the scenes, scout team, youth team, first team, Jimmy, right behind all teams, working 70, 80 hours a week for this club, night and day. He'd go miles and miles and extra miles to watch a young lad play. He would find that. He would sign lads, he would reassure their mams, he would rule them, he would school them, he would place them in his plans, he would coach them, he'd reproach them, he would get under their skin, he'd show kids that come from Collierst, you've greatness kid, within. He'd train with them, he'd train them, he'd fight them for the ball, inspire them and fire them to high and higher calls. He would stretch them, he would test them, he would polish them like gems. He would take them, he would shape them, he would make them fine young men. And then, when they were ready, and only then, he'd say, Boss, here is a player, and he's ready now to play. And when he spoke, and when... He spoke, wild arms, his eyes would glisten. Valley, chapel, pithead, war, your very soul would listen. A quiet man, Leviathan, loved symphonies you heard. This Welshman's love in music sung in every single word. Now listen, boys. Now listen up. The thing I must instill is... This is Manchester United. Let's hear old Jimmy still. They would hear him, they might fear him, but he took them to his home. He'd joke with them, he'd smoke with them, and treat them as his own. And he grew them, and he knew them, and he coached them all until they all loved him, really loved him. And those here, they love him still. No greater sight in football than United on the wing. No greater choir with greater fire than when the red choir sings. Young gods who played like angels with a devil on their chest. And all of Europe there before them scoring more each test. And then, and then, the clock stopped. 
the red, the flames, the snow, their names always remembered for the games we'll never know. Keep the red flag flying, Jim, said Busby, barely heard. They gave him his last rights there twice, and Jimmy gave his word, then plunged into all spotlights, all their coffins in the gym. Then pressures upon pressures upon pressures upon him. The calls made on his principles, the sticking to his guns, the calls he made to mothers, telling how they'd lost their sons. And he cried and prayed and tried and slaved and fought to put a team out, working, grieving, hurt, believing, never snuffed the dream out. And Jimmy took communion and his strength of faith still lingered with his rosary, his crucifix worn down between his fingers. And Duncan, Duncan Edwards, the best of all, they say, without farewell, just 22, he fought, but slipped away. And Jimmy put a team out on, he said, his proudest day. And by God, he flew the flag all right. It flew down Wembley Way. And Busby left his deathbed, reunited with his friend. We'll never die, we'll never die. They taught the Stretford end. We'll play on for ourselves, lads. We will play on for the badge. We will win the European Cup and show it to those lads. And it took magic. It took genius. It took Jimmy's way with kids. It took... It took your breath away. And they did, you know. They did. And sometimes human beings don't just sing. They make a sound that poets have no name for. It still echoes round this ground. And listen, you can hear it. It's called love. And it's the goal. Not 70,000 voices, but a city and its soul. And Sir Alex, he will tell you that the seeds that they had sown bore fruit in his rich harvests from the branches they had grown. And proudly, as a Welshman, proud of never giving up, let's remember this Welsh dragon breathed his fire to their World Cup. And for all of his achievements, he'd say hi among them sits. The day when he, a young man, bought his old man out the pit. Men like Jimmy Murphy and the fire that burns inside them, the men who came before them, and the ones who stood beside them. Let the ones no longer with us tell the ones lined up today. This is Manchester United built on Sir Matt Wusby Busby Way. There is a bond, there is a code, there is a way that Red should play and the future will be founded on the way we behave today. Let's take 58 and 68, a pinch of 99, and stir it in a cauldron called Old Trafford. For all time, use this history as an engine fired with sparks from all these embers used as fuel the next renewal that our grandchildren remember. And Jimmy Murphy wept here. Jimmy Murphy slept here and we promise to remember the great promise Jimmy kept here and each time you pass his statue if they ever ask you why then just point to his clenched fist and to the passion in his eye and then point to all the statues grouped together they're the ones together man united and forever cast in bronze then say this is Jimmy Murphy and you need to know his name and remember that he taught us how the Reds should play the game and remember how he flew the flag when this club hit rock bottom. He'll never die. We'll never die. He'll never be forgotten. Jimmy Murphy, old pal. Thank you, Jimmy Murphy.
Ladies and gentlemen, what a special way to end, a special event in tribute of an extraordinary man. And again, we thank each and every one of you, all of you, for attending and honouring the great, the one and only, Jimmy Murphy.